To reduce unnecessary burdens on the healthcare system and clients, refill-only visits should be considered separately to clinical visits. In most settings, clinical visits are required every six months, whereas the number of ART refill visits depends on the maximum duration of ART available. In this video, we will explore the standard operating procedure for an individual model based at a facility from the perspective of the client and the healthcare worker. In many settings, this type of model is known as Fast Track. Meet Samuel. Samuel is established on HIV treatment and has chosen a Fast Track model. At his last clinical visit with the nurse, he was given three months of medication and a second script for another three months. On the day of his refill visit, he only needs to go to the pharmacy at his clinic during opening hours to collect his medication. On arrival, he walks straight to the Fast Track pharmacy window past the triage desk, doesn't need to see the nurse, and goes directly to the pharmacy to the staff member allocated to dispense medication. At the fast track dispensing window, Samuel is asked if he's experiencing any problems. He confirms that he is fine. He receives his ART and cotrimoxazole refill for another three months. This process takes about 15 minutes. Let's look at the scenario from the healthcare worker's perspective. Today, Lindiwe is assigned to dispense ART refills. She has received training on the standard operating procedure and knows what documentation is needed for the refill process. Using the clinic appointment system, she has a list of who to expect for ART refills today and the receptionist has given her the necessary files. In her clinic, they pre-pack the medications. She sits at the fast track window of the pharmacy. Her first client explains that he is there to collect his ART refill. She asks how he's doing. He explains that he's feeling fine. So she continues and completes the scripting documentation for the client and gives him the medication. Without DSD, how might the scenario have played out? Without a fast track system, Samuel could have arrived to collect his ART and cotrimoxazole and had to sit in a queue to see a healthcare worker to provide another script and then stand in another queue at the pharmacy. Lindiwe knows that before having this fast track system, when clients needed to see the clinician to receive their scripts every three months, clinicians were having to see double the number of clients. Because of this, clients would often only reach the pharmacy mid-afternoon, meaning she would finish very late. 